Hi guys, before the summer ends, I have a little list I put together of my favorite products for the summer. Of course, we're gonna talk about sunscreen, but I'm also gonna talk about body sunscreen and an after sun milk and some other stuff I want you guys to know about because these are products I usually use every single day and these are brands that I trust a lot when it comes to sun protection. One thing I wanna mention is that I have dry skin, so most of these are targeted for drier to normal skin types, but don't worry, I also have two recommendations for combination skin types and oily ones. So let's just get started. Okay, so I'm gonna start with my favorite sunscreen and it's from Shiseido. I have used this sunscreen for years and years and years and this is called the Ultimate Sun Protection Cream. I have two because this one is almost empty and of course I have a backup. This is SPF 50 plus and is water resistant up to 80 minutes. Now, you guys know I suffer from dark spots. I used to have really, really bad dark spots. Long story short, I did the IPL laser and I got rid of them at the Dr. Dennis Gross Clinic in New York because I know you guys are gonna ask. Now my skin is sunspot free, but after that and before that, I've been really diligent about taking good care of my skin and using sunscreen and I've tried a ton and I've come to a conclusion that this one is by far my favorite, not in texture because I have some more that have a lighter texture, but if you suffer from dark spots, melasma or hyperpigmentation and you want to take really good care of your skin, this is the sunscreen you need to use. I have used this as I said before, like for the past maybe 10 years and the formula before was a bit annoying because it left an awful white cast. They reformulated, now it's even better. It doesn't leave a stronger white cast as before. It leaves a little bit of a white cast, I'm not gonna lie. It's creamy, it's a little bit thick but it sinks right in and one thing I need to mention with this sunscreen is that it holds my makeup amazingly in hot or humid weather and I think it's due to a water resistant factor in it. I know there are lighter textures in the market but since I want to have like the best protection this is what I tend to use every day if it's really sunny or if it's summer this is my go-to this is perfect to use if you're at the beach, in the pool, this is perfect to go outside if you're doing sports outside and if you sweat a lot, this will keep your skin protected and it will prevent you from sweating. That's why I think this is such an amazing primer for makeup in the summer because it kind of locks the sweat. Let me show you what it looks like. Yes, it leaves a little bit of a white cast, but for me that's not a problem because I know my skin is protected. And I swear guys, this makes my makeup look so pretty. And if I jump into the water, the technology of the sunscreen will adhere even more to my skin and it won't come off. So it's waterproof, it's sweatproof and it makes my makeup look flawless and last all day long. So yes, it's a thicker formula. Yes, it leaves a little bit of a white cast. But yes, it's the best one at protecting my skin fully from the sun. I love the sunscreen to death. If you want to have higher protection or serious protection, highly suggest trying this one. Now let's dive into an everyday sunscreen that I discovered recently. I told you guys at the beginning of the video I have dry skin and Kula recently came up with the full spectrum 360 sun silk drops. If you're looking for a lighter texture, you won't find anything as light as this. This is sort of like a watery type of serum. It's really hydrating. It makes my skin glow. So I usually love to use this when I'm staying in the house or on winter time or really dry days when my skin needs a little bit more hydration. The best thing about this sunscreen is that this protects my skin not only from the UVB and UVA, it protects my skin from, from blue light, from cell phones and computers. So if you're someone with dry skin, I wouldn't recommend this for combination to oily skin, but if you have dry to normal skin and if you work all day in front of a computer. I will highly recommend this one. This has the most lovely texture, it smells amazing, it's a pleasure to use. 
you can actually skip your moisturizer and just go straight for this because this will give you all the benefits also of a moisturizer it's amazing and it protects is the only one from the bunch i'm going to show you that protects from blue light so i love this one and i love kula this is an amazing brand so love this one for daily use now let's dive into the tinted sunscreen because i know a lot of people just don't want to use something white fake or they don't want to ruin the makeup so i'm going to show you three options that are sort of like tinted the first one is the lightest one and this one is from dr dennis grass i love the sunscreen so much this is the instant radiance sun defense sunscreen and this is broad spectrum spf 40 and this is the shade light to medium and i love this one because this gives the most beautiful radiance to the skin it like blurs in perfection because it's not a matte tint it has a little bit of a radiance in it so it makes my skin look so healthy and so beautiful let me show you how it looks so this is just a little bit and if i use it it doesn't leave a white cast and it doesn't have much coverage but it leaves my skin healthy glowy and super radiant i love this one this is the one i use uh, after i'm done with the gym and i'm going out because i already sweat i need to reapply my sunscreen so this is the one i always keep in my gym bag if you want a little bit of something a little bit of tint and a little bit of radiance together this is the perfect love this one next we have this powder sunscreen this is from color science and this is called the sun forgettable broad spectrum 50 plus this is such a good one if you want to touch up and you don't want to ruin your makeup this is perfect for on the go i always have it in my handbag just in case and they have quite a few shades my shade is actually fair because i tried the medium and it was just a little bit too orangey for my skin but this is a great option if you want to touch up and you don't want to ruin your makeup i always use something like this and then throughout the day if, if it's really sunny and i know i'm gonna get you know a little bit of sun exposure this is the one i use it's portable it's perfect is it doesn't wait so it's easier to keep on your handbag such a great and unique product from color science i love this one plus it's spf 50 so it's great highly suggest trying this one and the last one that is tinted i think i'm gonna cheat a little bit here but it's again from shiseido and this is their liquid foundation but this has uv protection of 42 and it's also water resistant and it comes in this little cute package you just shake it like this and you apply one thing i have to mention with this is that i love this foundation not only because it has high spf and it really protects my skin i love the formula because it has a beautiful velvety finish and it has a beautiful lightweight texture i think if this foundation didn't have the spf in it it will be one of my favorites i know i haven't talked about this on my instagram or on my blog but this is one of my favorite foundations and this is my go-to when it's summertime because it really protects my skin and fun fact when i was doing surf i was using this and i was using this on top because this no matter what if you jump into the water if you sweat a lot this won't come off but at the same time it looks very natural on the skin you guys know i love natural makeup so trust me when i say this looks natural it protects the skin it has a light texture such a good one with spf 40 if you want to skip sunscreen this is the way to go because this is the only foundation i have found that really 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 protects my skin so i'm gonna give you two recommendations for oily to combination don't worry i got you guys cover too and those come from kula and color science i'm gonna start with this one this is the mineral sunscreen unscented matte tint i i don't think this has coverage whatsoever if you know the professional from um, benefit this has the exact same texture it has a whip texture it's matte but it's not drying on the skin and it blurs the pores this is perfect for normal to combination to oily skin types but this is perfect for people that hate the texture of sunscreen because this doesn't feel like sunscreen it doesn't smell like sunscreen and it just really honestly blurs the pores on your skin it goes on really really smooth 
and it feels like a yeah like a silicone primer it feels a little bit more slippery than, than the professional this is the one my husband uses and he really likes it from the bunch this is the one I think most people are gonna love it because it doesn't feel like sunscreen. It smells really good. I think this is one of their best selling products. And I have another one that's exactly the same from Color Science. This is the box, this is how it looks, and this is the Daily UV Protector Whip Mineral Sunscreen. Again, both of these have like that whip texture that feels amazing on the skin and it's a pleasure to use it because you don't feel you're using a sunscreen. This one is tinted too. This is just a little bit darker and you can see that moussey texture. And if you're really, really oily or if you're a guy and you hate anything that leaves a shine on the skin, I think this one is even more mattifying than this one. So if you're a combination or really, really oily, I highly, highly suggest trying this one. Again, from Color Science, this one is SPF 30 and this one is SPF 32. Two great options, two amazing textures that you won't find anywhere else, I think. For the body, I gotta go with Kula. This is the Ecolux Port Sunscreen SPF 50 in the Guava Mango scent. They have many scents and I love all of them. This smells amazing. I love the packaging. I love how easy it is to use because you just push and you can reach your whole body without needing help. And one thing I love is that it's the sunscreen is a bit moisturizing but it's not sticky so when I apply it I feel like my skin is hydrated protected not drying but also it dries really quickly so the sand uh, won't stick to my skin love Kula and I love 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 the packaging and I love all the scents so this is my go-to for the body now let's jump into protection for the hair because Kula recently launched this product and it's called the Ocean Salted Sage Scalp and Hair Mist. I already tried it and I love it so much. It has like this cool spread and you can use it from root to tip and if you don't have hair you can use it on your scalp too and it will protect your scalp. It's packed, it's 70% organic, it has SPF 30 and it's packed of amazing nutrients and ingredients to protect your hair and protect your color if you have color treated hair. Now let's move a little bit into after sun care. If you're a little bit sunburned or you need your skin is really dry after a day at the beach, I recently discovered this. This is from Moroccan oil and this is called the Moroccan oil after sun milk. First it has the Moroccan oil scent which I'm addicted. I love anything with the Moroccan oil scent but this has such a beautiful milky texture so you just it's super easy because you just spray it in like this and it just gives a light hydration it sinks right in but it calms your skin if it's sunburn or if it's irritated plus it smells amazing as i said before so if you're looking for something rather than using your regular aloe i love aloe vera gel i think it's very effective but it's really drying on the skin so this is a great option. Yes, it's a little bit expensive, but it smells amazing. It makes my skin glow, it sinks right in. It's not sticky at all. I mean, I love the texture, I love the scent, I love everything about it. Love the packaging. Different option from your regular aloe vera gel. Really, really good one from Moroccan Oil. And the last product comes from Rituals. It's a sun protection body oil with SPF 30. So. It's really cool because it's not sticky. It's not a dry oil and it's not a regular oil. It's like something in between. It has the most beautiful scent and you're supposed to use this instead of your sunscreen because it's really easy to spray and it will give you that beautiful glow. So I love to use this. This is crazy, but I love to use this at night or on daytime when I'm showing my skin. If I'm wearing a sleeveless dress or a sleeveless shirt, or if I'm wearing a skirt, a short, a mini dress, I put this on my legs and this makes my skin glow. It's the perfect te texture, it smells amazing and it makes my skin look healthy and glowy and hydrated and supple. I am obsessed with this. This is such a great product just to use when you're showing your skin. Yes, it's great at the beach. If you're gonna use it for that, it's great. But this is like the trick I use to make my skin look so pretty so healthy so shiny 
not sticky at all and it smells so good so try this if you're showing some skin day or night you need to try this and that's why i left this one for last i love this i love this love 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 i'm gonna stop talking now and that's it you guys hope you like this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and please leave in the comments below which ones are your sunscreen or go-to summer products for the beach and i'll see you guys next week with more videos bye